Fiona Energy, a leading company in renewable energy sources, is a pioneer in the production of electricity from biomass combustion. The capacity of its biomass plant near Sanguesa is 25 megawatts. It generates 200 million kilowatt hours a year, works for 8,000 hours, and burns 160,000 metric tons of straw per annum. 50 million euros have been invested in this plant. Acciona's biomass plant, in service since 2002, is located in the industrial park at Sanguesa, Navarre, northern Spain. It consists of three buildings, the warehouse, the boiler and turbine house, and the office area. The plant has a very special appearance. The architects designed a single steel roof to cover the three buildings. Natural light enters through large polycarbonate skylights. A visitor's gallery allows the entire process to be observed without interfering with it. The process that finishes with the generation of electricity in the plant starts with the collection of straw from the fields. The bales are then taken from the straw sheds to the biomass plant. Three bridge cranes unload the bales. Each bale is separated into small pieces at the entry to the boiler and the straw falls into the oven through a vibrating grill. The combustion of the straw heats the water that circulates through pipes in the boiler wall and converts it into steam. This steam, now at 550 degrees centigrade, is sent to a superheater and then to a turbine connected to a generator that produces electricity. The power generated is transformed to 66 kilovolts in a substation located in the plant and is then transmitted through underground channeling to the grid substation at Sanguesa for injection into the national grid. Meanwhile, the steam is taken from the turbine to a condenser. Once there, it's cooled by water taken from a canal that runs through the industrial park and is converted back to water again. The water is then transported through pipes in the boiler wall to start the process over again. The water in the open circuit that has been used for cooling is returned to the canal. The Sanguisa biomass plant is beneficial for the environment. Every year it avoids the emission of around 200,000 metric tons of carbon dioxide from conventional coal-fired power stations. The gases from the straw combustion are passed through a smoke filter before being released into the atmosphere. Unburnt materials from the combustion and the ashes generated are stored in hoppers and are later used as agricultural fertilizers. Thanks to its size, technology and fuel management system, the biomass plant is a benchmark in the use of straw for producing energy. Sanguisa is the first plant in southern Europe to demonstrate the viability of biomass as a means of contributing to compliance with key strategic objectives such as decreasing CO2 emissions, reducing our energy dependence, stimulating new forms of rural development. Following the entry into service of Sanguesa, Acciona's continue to drive growth in the biomass sector with new plants at Briviesca, Burgos and Miajadas, Cáceres. The last named is the first one in Spain to combine grassy and woody raw materials. These plants make an essential mission for Acciona, a reality on a daily basis, to actively contribute to the implementation of an energy model that guarantees the sustainability of the world we live in.